Let's go, champ. What's good with the YouTube fight fans all over the world? It's your boy, the realest of the real. Yes, sir. I said it. Real talk boxing. It is a privilege and honor and a major blessing to be back with you beautiful people yet again. If you cannot tell, I am excited. I, after after the Josh Taylor versus, Lord, let me get this dude's name right, Jack Catterall. I'm satisfied with this fight that I just watched. We had the 115-pound division, I believe junior bantamweight champion, German, German, German. Ancajas versus Fernando Martinez. This was one of the best fights I've seen. I mean, it reminded me of Gotti Ward. If you missed this fight, you missed a grand fight. Now, I ain't talking about skill set. I'm not talking about strategic. I'm talking about a rock'em, sock'em. These dudes ain't human. Like, these dudes can't be human. They took so much punishment. They threw so many punches that they cannot be human. Like, if they are human, they power rangers. Because tonight we had Tommy the Green Ranger versus Jason the Red Ranger. These dudes were going back and forth, body shots for days, body snatching for days, up because phone booth type fighting all night. They were willing to die, both of them. They were willing to die. And Ancajas, this was his... I think ninth, tenth defense of his title. I don't even know who these dudes was. But I can tell you this. Fernando Martinez came out on top. Unanimous decision. He is promoted and managed by none other than Marcos Maidana, who gave me one of the most gratifying wins when he beat Adrian Broner. We threw a party. I I I, I almost I contemplated doing a backflip, but at the time I was I was pretty overweight. So I knew better. But listen, these guys showed resilience, grit, nuts, guts. But they're not going to have a long career. They get hit a lot. They really do. This wasn't a fight of finesse. This was a fight of heart, grit, and who wanted it. And Martinez, Fernando Martinez wanted it more. This dude, like, lost his dad. He went into a depression, dealt with alcoholism. And he came out on top. His dad said, you're going to be world champion. Told his trainer, my son will be world champion. And tonight, he proved his dad right. This was crazy. This was crazy. We ain't even, this was just the first fight. Now we got uh, Gary Russell Jr.'s brother about to fight uh, Victor Postal, which is a huge step up for Russell. And then we got Colbert, Col Colbert versus, uh, I think his name is Martinez too. And we ain't even, we just not getting started. Did y'all see this fight? Did you see this fight? Now, when you watch it, don't think you're going to see a lot of Floyd Mayweather finesse, ducking and jiving. It's rock'em, sock'em, Gotti Ward type fight. I loved it. I'm a fan of these both. I'm, I'm a fan of both of these fighters now. Didn't know who they were before tonight. Didn't know who they were. I just spit. It just, I'm excited. This was a gratifying fight. And I... Love the fact that Mr. Jack Reese, the referee, stayed out of the way and was invisible. Great job, Reese. Great job to both these fighters. Salute to you, man. When y'all wake up in the morning, y'all probably ain't going to be able to move. Y'all going to be so so. They took so much punishment and dished out so much punishment. They, they were not taking no for an answer. And these dudes, I'm telling you, they were willing to die. Both of them were willing to die. Did you see it? If not, please go check it out. The highlights something comment down below and let me know what you think about it i gotta go back in and finish the fights as always respect all fear none god bless to the next time real talk boxing i'm up and i'm out of here bye y'all